See, it's all fun and games until you're like, Honey, I don't think the kids can see any of these birds. I don't think it's appropriate that any of them see the birds. And then your wife looks at you like you're a moron and says, It says exotic. And you're like, Oh. Okay. I may have forgot to mention that this takes place at the zoo. I probably messed that up. I'll do better next time. I was kind of drawing out the blueprints for what like my super mega studio would look like, okay? The studio I'm about to get into is going to be a portable studio and then uh, if if everything pans out like amazingly super it's nothing I'm like this is the reason I'm showing you is cuz I don't really think it is going to pan out like in anytime soon, but this would be the uh, the layout. I want to. I definitely want my studio to have a storefront, where it's like, look, it's a store, and then have like a soda machine that opens up, and then you walk down the aisle here. You have just a workstation here. That'd be a chair right here, workstation, and like little areas where I can put sets and stuff like that. But then that'd be the storefront. Yeah, just an idea. It's my car. Okay. It just smells like you. I smell like grease you from working stink. at Chick-fil-A. I hate it. And, and working the grease machine, just grease, dropping the grease and getting the grease smoke all over me. And I'm just, I smell greasy. You stinky. Of greasy. Honey. Morning hair. Well, besides, at least. But uh, <laughs> I found out that uh, yesterday I found out that Thug Notes has a podcast. So I'm like, oh yes, I'm listening to this. Thug, if you don't know about Thug Notes, Thug Notes is on the Wisecrack uh, YouTube channel, and it's basically it's it's funny and intellectual and awesome and really fun to watch. So uh, I look forward to listening to this podcast. I think they have another one. I gotta watch another video to find out which one that is, and then I'll probably subscribe to that one on my podcast listening device. Okay, today we are going to go into the barn. That's the barn. And we are going to condense our boxes so that we have less boxes whenever we move into the RV. So that, um, because the RV is smaller than the ones we were looking at. So we have to condense our stuff so that we take what we need and don't take a bunch of junk that we don't need. So we're going to be doing that today. And right now I am looking for a podcast to listen to while I do that. Hopefully something educational, maybe something funny. Maybe that podcast I talked about before. Oh, Wisecrack also has another one with his, which is hitting meanings of movies. Good stuff. I had to re-record this because the other one, the other video, the other take of this I did, I kept on saying trailer. It's not a trailer. It's an RV. And and then I was doing this, which makes my eyes squint, and I look all, like I just got punched in the face. So I was like, nah, I'll do another take, and that that take was better. It is early morning, so I have like a old raspy, a deeper raspy voice. That's that's my morning voice. Totally do uh, trailers or something. Be like, coming this fall, action movie, Sylvester Stallone, Arnold Schwarzenegger, a movie where you could hardly hear or understand what the person is saying. This fall. 